All right, now it's time for part three of our five and a half by 14 wood shell snare drum shootout. These are all eight ply drums. Just to remind you, they have eight lugs, single point lugs. They're identical. Um, the only thing different is the wood that's being used. These are all made by Bucks County Drums. Last week we had maple, birch, and walnut. This week we've got cherry, ash, and oak. So let's check each one out individually. Let's start with cherry. Our cherry is actually the softest wood in all six that we're checking out. If you look at the Jenka hardness scale, it sits at 950. So you compare that with maple, which was the hardest, which was 1450. So quite a bit softer. Um, the grain you'll see in the video when you look at the drum, the grain is, is a little bit more wide open, but it's not a very porous wood. It's pretty smooth. Um, I think the porosity plays a big role into how much resonance the shell has. And, you know, in addition to everything else, how thick is it, how many plies, how hard is the wood, what's the, the grain structure of the wood. The porosity seems to be the next characteristic and maybe even more important than some of the others. It's a pretty smooth wood with a nice wide grain. So let's take a listen. This is the cherry drum from high down to super low. And now here is where I felt like this drum sounded best on that particular day. Next up is the oak shell drum. This, it's actually red oak. There's different types of oak species out there. The drum that, uh, the, the, the wood that Chris used to make this is red oak. The Janka hardness is 1220, which is just slightly softer than the yellow birch was at 1260. And the walnut, it's a little bit harder than the walnut, which was at 1010. So it's right in the middle of the hardness of this batch, but it has a very open grain and a very it's very porous. What does that translate to in my experience with the drum? 
shorter sustain, faster decay, which means less inclination for muffling. You just get a nice big tone and then the heads just kind of die down in a nice smooth but quick way. Let's take a listen, high to low. And here is my favorite tuning on that day on the Red Oak drum. And last but not least, we have ash. Ash is, I'm looking at all the hardnesses here. It's actually the second hardest wood of the six that we have here to test. It is 1320 on the Jenka hardness scale, which is just below maple and above birch. But like oak, it is a very wide open grain and very porous. This is a wood where, where you, you can feel the texture. Oak and, and ash both had this, where you could feel the texture in the wood itself. Again, it translates into a shorter note. How does it compare to oak? Let's check it out. High to low.
And here is my favorite tuning with the ass drum on that particular day in my studio. All right, that wraps up our close look at these six different 5.5 by 14 8 ply wood species drums by Bucks County. Hopefully this helped train your ear to hear some of the differences, the subtle differences, the drastic differences between them all. Um, and then hopefully you have your favorites of the bunch. All of these drums will be on sale shortly, just so you know. So you might want to reserve your favorite now if you really like one of them. Um, hit me up. Um, but anyway, we're going to come back to this and I'm going to do more of a blindfold test to see how much of it is really perceived when you have no idea which drum is being put in front of you. Can you really pick out your favorite amongst these six? Mm -hmm.